Hi guys, welcome back. So today we're gonna try to feed the new uh, chin wrist uh, from the Whitner company and uh, yeah, I'm just gonna show you how to do it very quickly. I'm gonna first start uh, by removing my existing chin wrist. So this is the chin rest that I'm gonna try to fit in and I'm gonna use the little screwdriver that actually came uh, with the set in the box. Uh, if you saw my previous video, um, I was showing you how to put this chin rest together because there's many different pieces and many options that you can have. So uh, yeah, let's try to do it. So let's see, I'm gonna... So it's obviously it goes over the tailpiece and I need to move this down a little bit. So I just want to show you guys that um, this chin rest has, see there are inside a little screws right here. So you're going to need that screwdriver to really tighten uh, those screws once, um, once you fit into your instrument. That's why you need all those tools. What I have to do now is to tighten the screw. So I'm gonna kind of flip it, the violin to the side. go this is how it looks from the back this is the side view so as you see the plate is a little bit goes a little bit higher than the original chin rest that I have there we go and let me show you the other side view there we go that's how it looks from the other side and as you can see those brackets sit very nicely I didn't really have any trouble tightening them um, looks pretty good and there's obviously a cork on those little feet in here so it's not gonna damage your instrument if you remember from my previous video there's a little um, like a rubber section here so it's also um, you know it's not gonna yeah, you can see this little section right in here it's not going to um, damage your instrument is right there there we go guys, so this is how it looks like. Um, I think it's a very nice uh, chin rest. I'm gonna go ahead and try it and play on it for a little bit while uh, before I write a review of my on my blog site. So um, yeah, but I wanted to show you how to put it on. As you can see, it's not a very complicated process. Um, and what I like so far about the chin rest is the fact that you have so many uh, little parts that you can actually, if you feel like this chin rest should be higher, uh, you can use a different uh, kind of attachments, different brackets that comes in the in this kit. And I, I show you this in the last video. So you can actually um, have this chin rest set a lot higher if you wish to. I put on the lowest setting because I like to keep it low, but um, yeah, it's completely customizable. It's completely up to you the way you want to do it. So, um, yeah. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please subscribe if you haven't yet. Give it a thumbs up. Click on the notification bell. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye, guys.